So here we are, we're going to be making a magic bottle holder for construction one. Um, we got our selection of pine beetle kill wood. Um, the width of the wood usually is supposed to be about two and three quarters. So this wood is actually exactly two and three quarters, but it can be a little bit larger than that. That's perfectly fine too. The first thing we have to do is decide our length. And our length for this project has to be eight and one quarter inches. So here I am, I'm gonna measure eight and one quarter inches. Okay, so I have eight and one quarter inches. I just have a small amount to take off. I'm gonna have this be the top of my project and this be the bottom. In the bottom here, we're going to have to cut a 43 to 45 degree angle, but we'll w wait and do that later and just keep that in mind. Um, now we have to, we're going to have to put a hole right around in this vicinity, so we need to measure from our base, which I'm going to measure from my line, up 6 and 5 eighths inches. Here we are. Now I'm going to use a square and draw my line across there. That'll have to be the center of the hole. We'll have to use this to base that. Okay, now we're gonna have to find the middle of this width of wood. Um, and since it's two and three quarters, that's gonna be one and three eighths. So, got measures of that here. my square again so then I'll have the exact middle of the wood and I'm just going to draw it where I do that line across and that cross there right there that's going to be the where we're going to have to put the center of the bit so we'll drill a hole there cut an angle down here and we have everything ready. Okay. We're just about to start the cut the 45 degree angle and we're going to cut it we start back and then we push the button we push it down Sandpaper with 150 grit, and we're just going to sand all the edges and inside and around the hole except for the part where you cut the angle at 45 degrees. So, so we're gonna finish our magic bottle holder. Right here we're going to finish with the canola oil, oil to bring out the grain of the wood and its natural effects on the pine bark beetle kill. It's rubbing it all around. We want to get it all nicely. It's kind of like uh, lotion for the oil you could say. I mean for the wood. Now that we've finished all the oiling to bring out its natural color, we gotta let it sit for X amount of time so it has time to dry. Okay, and this is our finished bottle, magic bottle holder. It holds perfectly, you just gotta take it home and use it. There you go.